In this video, I'll show you how to quickly make a procedural stone texture in Blender. Okay, so let's start off by pressing X to delete and then Shift A and add a monkey. And then we can press Control 5 for five subdivisions. And then in the world settings, I'm going to make the background a bit darker. And then let's turn the light into a sun, set the strength to five. And then you can press R twice to rotate freely. And then we're also going to switch to cycles in order to make the shaders look as good as possible. And if you have a GPU, make sure to use it. If not, just keep using the CPU. And then we can open a new window by dragging the top right corner and go into the shader editor. And then select the monkey, add a new material. And then you can press Shift A to add a new node. We're going to add a bump node, connect normal to normal. And then we need to add a noise texture to get some bumpiness and then connect factor to height. And then we need to adjust the values. So let's start off by increasing the detail to 15. Then we can also change the color, the metallic value, and also the roughness and the distance in the bump node. And we're starting to get something that looks like a stone shader. And you can also add some colors by adding a color ramp in between the noise texture and the base color. So just play around with the different colors until you get some cool results.